Well, today we learned of more developments when it comes to allegations of sexual harassment and misconduct involving Governor Andrew Cuomo. One woman is taking her accusations to the Albany County Sheriff's Office. Two on your side's Jackie Roberts joins us now with an update. Jackie. Yeah, Claudine, today the Albany County Sheriff held a news conference to address this latest development. He says they're in the very early stages of the investigation, so information is still limited. Sheriff Craig Apple told reporters late this week a woman who's referred to as executive assistant number one in the attorney general's report filed a former complaint alleging criminal conduct against the governor. He wouldn't get into the specifics of her allegations, but did say the conduct was sexual in nature. However, in the attorney general's report, it's alleged that she was groped by Cuomo at the governor's mansion. Sheriff Apple says their meeting marks the beginning of the investigative process for the Albany County Sheriff's Office. It's a group of investigators that are trained to handle sexual assault investigations as well as regular criminal investigations. They're very well trained, they're very professional, and they're very thorough. Sheriff Apple says his office has requested investigative material from the attorney general and the private counsel that they had hired out, and they're waiting to review what comes back. A spokesperson for the attorney general released a statement this afternoon saying, quote, we will cooperate fully with the Albany sheriff and turn over all evidence related to this complaint. Of course, as this case unfolds, we'll keep you updated with the latest information on air and on WGRZ.com. Jackie Roberts, Channel 2 News.